Welcome to the Daily Psalms. My name is Hunter Barnes. I am your guide through the Psalms this year. The Psalms have been a prayer book for God's people as we read through them daily. Allow these meditations to direct your heart's prayers to God. Today is Psalm 79 from the New Living Translation. Meditations of the Heart. Psalm 79. A Psalm of Asaph. O God, pagan nations have conquered your land, your special possession. They have defiled your holy temple and made Jerusalem a heap of ruins. They have left the bodies of your servants as food for the birds of heaven. The flesh of your godly ones has become food for the wild animals. Blood has flowed like water all around Jerusalem. No one is left to bury the dead. We are mocked by our neighbors, an object of scorn and derision to those around us. O oh Lord, how long will you be angry with us? Forever? How long will you jealously burn like fire? Pour out your wrath on the nations that refuse to acknowledge you, on kingdoms that do not call upon your name. For they have devoured your people Israel, making the land a desolate wilderness, do not hold us guilty for the sins of our ancestors. Let your compassion quickly meet our needs, for we are on the brink of despair. Oh, help us, O oh God of our salvation. Help us for the glory of your name. Save us and forgive our sins for the honor of your name. Why should pagan nations be allowed to scoff, asking, where is their God? Show us your vengeance against the nations for they have spilled the blood of your servants. Listen to the moaning of the prisoners. Demonstrate your great power by saving those condemned to die. O Lord, pay back our neighbors seven times for the scorn they have hurled at you. Then we, your people, the sheep of your pasture, will thank you forever and ever, praising your greatness from generation to generation. Psalm 79 Meditations of the Heart If you'd like to go further in the scriptures, follow us at dailyradiobible.com where we read through the entire Bible over the course of a year. But more than that, we desire to have an encounter with the God who is love. Be sure to follow and subscribe to this podcast wherever you listen. And find out more at dailyradiobible.com. Until tomorrow, remember this, that you are loved.